From robots that can dance better than most humans to mechanical powerhouses that are revolutionizing industries, Boston Dynamics is turning the world of tomorrow into the reality of today. In this video, we're going to take you on a thrilling journey through the evolution of this groundbreaking robotics company. But be warned, once you see what these robots can do, there's no going back. So, are you ready to step into the future? Boston Dynamics started off making training videos for the Navy, but soon they took a leap into the future and started creating robots. Their creations are so extraordinary they could be straight out of a blockbuster sci-fi movie. They've come a long way since their first creation, Big Dog. This robot, once the most ambitious legged robot, now seems like a clumsy ancestor compared to its high-tech descendants. But it was their Do You Love Me video that really shook the internet. In less than three minutes, they give us a glimpse of a future where robots could dance and move with a grace that left viewers spellbound. Some skeptics claimed it was all CGI, but the truth is even more astonishing. The robots are just that good. But how did they achieve this? Stay tuned to find out. First up, there's Spot, the sleek and agile successor of Big Dog. Spot can navigate almost any terrain with ease, making it perfect for inspections and data collection. And the best part? It can do all of this on its own. Spot can even be fitted with a robotic arm, a light, and a 4K camera, so it can inspect objects before picking them up. In other words, if Spot wants to go for a walk, it doesn't wait for anyone. It just opens the door and off it goes. But what can Spot do that no other robot can? We'll reveal that in a moment. Then there's Stretch, the powerhouse. Built for industrial work, Stretch can unload trucks and stack pallets all by itself. Despite its size, it moves with the grace of a ballet dancer, easily navigating through factories or warehouses while carrying its load. This means it can do different jobs without needing any special setup. But what makes Stretch so unique? Keep watching to find out. But the real showstopper is Atlas, the world's most advanced humanoid robot. Atlas was first introduced in 2013, and it's been upgraded since then to become a fully operational, 5-foot-tall, 190-pound marvel with 28 moving parts. It can move at a top speed of 2.5 meters per second, and it uses complex algorithms to handle different and changing situations. But what's the secret behind Atlas's incredible capabilities? We'll reveal that soon. So, what does this mean for us? Boston Dynamics envisions a world where robots are our helpful sidekicks, not our mechanical overlords. Their robots are designed to do dangerous jobs that are best not assigned to humans, like checking power lines or inspecting construction sites. But, as experts have pointed out, robots and smart algorithms could take over a lot of jobs in the 21st century. But what jobs are we talking about? Stay tuned to find out. Even though Boston Dynamics presents the robots in a positive light, there's a darker side to consider. Boston Dynamics started by making robots for the military, like mechanical animals to carry things for soldiers. It's not hard to imagine Atlas as a robot super soldier, without any human weaknesses. But such soldiers would also lack human kindness and morality. But what's the real danger here? We'll delve into that later. Other companies, like US firm Ghost Robotics, are less worried about making their robots into weapons. Ghost Robotics recently showed a four-legged robot with a gun on its back, and their robots are already being tested by the US military, which could lead to future robot soldiers. This has made some groups call for a ban on robot soldiers and military machines. Whether these lethal autonomous weapons systems, or laws, will ever be used in battle is still unknown. But if Boston Dynamics' progress is any indication, it won't be long before robots have a big role in our lives. But what role exactly? We'll explore that shortly. The future will probably be a mix of home and military uses. At home, robots will take over some of the most dangerous jobs, marking the biggest change in technology use since the internet started. On the battlefield, robots will probably see action sooner rather than later, even if they don't look exactly like Arnold Schwarzenegger's Terminator. But what does this mean for us? Boston Dynamics, along with several other leading robotics companies, has taken a firm stance against the weaponization of their robots. In an open letter to the robotics industry and their communities, they express their belief that advanced mobile robots will provide great benefit to society as co-workers in industry and companions in our homes. However, they also acknowledge the potential for misuse, particularly in the area of weaponization. 
They stated, We believe that adding weapons to the robots that are remotely or autonomously operated, widely available to the public, and capable of navigating to previously inaccessible locations where people live and work, raises new risks of harm and serious ethical issues. They also expressed concern that weaponized applications of these newly capable robots could harm public trust in the technology, thereby damaging the tremendous benefits they could bring to society. For these reasons, Boston Dynamics and the other signatories of the letter pledged not to weaponize their advanced mobility, general purpose robots, or the software they develop that enables advanced robotics. They also pledged not to support others in doing so and committed to carefully reviewing their customers' intended applications to avoid potential weaponization. They further pledged to explore the development of technological features that could mitigate or reduce these risks. However, they acknowledge that their commitment alone is not enough to fully address these risks. Therefore, they called on policymakers to work with them to promote the safe use of these robots and to prohibit their misuse. They also called on every organization, developer, researcher, and user in the robotics community to make similar pledges not to build, authorize, support, or enable the attachment of weaponry to such robots. In conclusion, Boston Dynamics envisions a future where robots are our helpful sidekicks, not our mechanical overlords. Their robots are designed to do dangerous jobs that are best not assigned to humans, like checking power lines or inspecting construction sites. They are committed to ensuring that their robots are used for the benefit of society and not for causing harm or intimidation. This pledge against weaponization is a testament to their commitment to ethical robotics and their vision for a future where robots and humans work side by side to tackle some of the world's challenges. So, what does this pledge mean for the future robotics? How will it influence the development and use of robots in various sectors? And most importantly, will other robotics companies follow suit and make similar pledges? These are questions that will shape the future of robotics and our interaction with these advanced machines. Let's delve deeper into the implications of this pledge. By committing to non-weaponization, Boston Dynamics is setting a precedent for the robotics industry. This could lead to a shift in the focus of robotics development, steering it away from military applications and towards more beneficial uses. For instance, we could see more advancements in robots designed for disaster response, healthcare, and environmental conservation. Moreover, this pledge could also influence the regulations surrounding robotics, with leading companies like Boston Dynamics advocating for ethical use of robots, policymakers might be more inclined to enact laws that prevent the misuse of this technology. This could result in a safer and more controlled environment for the deployment of advanced robots. However, this pledge also raises some challenges. One of the main issues is enforcement. How can Boston Dynamics ensure that their robots are not weaponized by third parties after they've been sold? This is a complex problem that will require innovative solutions such as developing tamper-proof systems or tracking technologies. Another challenge is the potential for a gap in the market. If leading robotics companies refuse to develop weaponized robots, this could open the door for less scrupulous companies to fill this niche. This could lead to a proliferation of weaponized robots developed without the same ethical considerations. Despite these challenges, Boston Dynamics' pledge against weaponization is a significant step towards a future where robots are used for the betterment of society. It shows that they are not only committed to pushing the boundaries of what robots can do, but also to ensuring that their creations are used responsibly. So, what do you think? Are Boston Dynamics' robots as harmless as they are smart? Or are we creating a new robot ruling class? Let us know in the comments below. Enjoyed the video? Now watch this one.